Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So for those of you who are new, my name is Ashley Birch and I post mommy related content. So today's video is going to be a review. Um, if you don't already know, my daughter is a little over a year old and for the first five and a half, almost six months, she would not take a bottle. We could not get her to take a bottle to save our lives. And it was not until we got the star of this video, the Como Tomo bottle right here, that she started taking a bottle. So I wanted to review this bad boy for you because I love it. It has been a lifesaver and I'm just really happy that we went ahead and purchased it. I knew nothing about it. I actually saw an ad for it on Facebook and thought it looked cool and we'd already given several other bottles a try and I thought, why not? What's one more bottle? So I purchased it and could not be happier. I think that my daughter started taking this bottle because it is the most breast-like bottle that I've found yet. If you've tried this bottle, leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think about it. <laughs> okay, let's get right on into this video. So we have here, like I said, the Como Tomo bottle. This bottle is eight ounce. They also have a five ounce bottle. Keep in mind, when you're buying the eight ounce bottle, it's going to come with a fast flow nipple. The five ounce bottle comes with slow flow. If you are a breastfeeding mom, go with the slow flow nipple. Any lactation specialist will tell you that, oh, a hummingbird just went by my window. Oh, that was a squirrel moment. Any lactation specialist will tell you that you want to make it as difficult for your baby to get milk from the bottle as possible. That's going to help because it's more work for them to nurse from your breast than it's going to be from a bottle. So making it as, as difficult as possible to get it from the bottle is going to cause less confusion for them. And not you guys, but if something's easier for me to eat, like if I'm cooking dinner and hey, I have this pizza that I can just toss in the oven, hey, I have something that I have to slave over the stove for, I'm gonna go with that pizza. It is no different for, for your baby than it is for you. So if they can get it easier and quicker from a bottle, why wouldn't they go that route? A few more things to know about this is this bottle has a wide base nipple. I also have here this Playtex bottle and just comparing the two, you can see this bottle, which is one that we tried and Parker wouldn't take, has a much smaller nipple base than this. Any lactation specialist, again, will tell you, you want your baby to have the widest latch when they're nursing. So this wide base is again gonna cause less confusion as something like this. So this is going to make it easier for you to nurse your baby and bottle feed because there will be less confusion. Again, something really cool about this bottle as compared to one like this is the nipple, the actual nipple here is shorter than most nipples are going to be. So when your baby is nursing, they're stimulating the top palate in their mouth. And if you have something that is less stimulating like your nipple would be, that's going to cause less confusion. If they have something that's going reaching to the back of their mouth, like a longer nipple such as this, that's causing more stimulation and it's gonna be more confusing and it's gonna be easier for your baby to nurse from a bot or to drink from a bottle as opposed to nursing. So just keep that in mind. I guess I should tell you the price point for a five ounce bottle, it's going to be, um, Parker June. For one five ounce bottle, it's $12.99. I'm sure you can find it elsewhere if you want to, but um, I'll link below uh, Cubby Corner or um, a website where you can find bottles like this um, for two, eight ounce bottles, um, I believe the going price is $23.99. So that gives you like a rough price point for these bottles, but they are worth it. The silicone base, I'll show you here, it's squishy, but towards the top, it gets firmer. So you have this squishy bottom here that the baby can knead and play with while they're nursing like they would from your breast, 
but yet you have this harder top base. The inside silicone is a non-stick silicone, so it makes cleaning this bottle super easy. So it has no ridges except for where the bottle screws onto the lid. And same with the inside. There's no ridges other than where it just twists on. So that's really great. That makes it easy to clean and sanitize. While sanitizing this bottle, you can go the typical old school route where you boil it for five minutes and let it air dry. But you can also use the microwave safe steam bags or steam sanitizing bags. But it's also dishwasher safe. So my husband and I just disassemble it plop everything in the top rack and wash normal in the dishwasher. I did see that people were having problems with it leaking. If you put it together properly, it's not going to cause any leaking. So just keep in mind that you wanna make sure this inner rim is just nice and secure there. And then secure this on nice and tight and you're good to go. There will be no leaking. I have not had a problem with that whatsoever. Bottles are always going to be easier for your baby to use, but using something like the Komotomo bottle here, where it has a wide nipple base, a shorter nipple than you would typically see, that's gonna cause less confusion. Also, the silicone base of the bottle is more lifelike. Your baby's going to be able to kind of squish it around like they would when they were actually nursing. So, I would personally give this bottle five stars in my opinion, it is the best bottle that I've used. I haven't used them all, but I used a ton. This is the only thing that worked in the beginning. So now she's older and she's drinking from a water bottle and that sort of thing, but I did wanna give this a review because it was the best bottle that we used. The only bottle that worked in the beginning. So big thumbs up for this bottle. And I guess that concludes this video. There's nothing else I can say except this bottle is amazing. It also comes in green. I'm not sure if there's any other colors for it other than pink and green, but definitely go on the website. I will link one below for you. Check it out and go ahead and subscribe and click the bell notification. That way you don't miss out on any future videos. And yeah, I guess I'll see you in my next video. Have a great day.